you have a test coming up and you need to memorize this chart. Maybe you need to memorize this one, which is the same concept as the last one, but it looks different. Okay, this is what you're going to do. When you get the test, you copy this chart down. The numbers on the top are the number of lone electron pairs, and the numbers on the side are the number of electron groups. Then, when a question about Vesper comes up, you just look at the chart you wrote down. I'm going to teach you how to copy this chart down the easy way. Start by writing the numbers 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 down on this side, and then go up a line and write 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. You have to get these numbers right. If you don't, you're going to be in big trouble. Now, write linear in the first box, and now watch this. It's a staircase. Going down the staircase, write bent, bent, linear, linear. Going up the staircase, T-shape, T-shape. That's it. Bent, bent, linear, linear, T-shape, T-shape. That's like half of the chart already. Now let's memorize the yellow box. Look at that. Tri means three. Tetra means four. That's just what the prefix means. So you can remember those two by the prefix. Look at this. Tri is three, bi is two. 3 plus 2 is 5. And octahedral, um, 8 minus 2 is 6. Okay, that's how you memorize that one. Now let's move to the orange box, the last one. I like to think of this one as a triangle head man on a box. Look at this. Okay, so it kind of looks like a man with a triangle head on a box. Oh, and there's also a second box next to him. Don't ask how that got there. Okay, so you see the triangle? Trigonal, pyramidal. This looks like a seesaw. Seesaw. This is a square, square pyramidal. Both of the pyramidal ones in this one are just pyramidal. Only The only bipyramidal is in this yellow box. And then the last one left is square planar. So you just got to memorize that one.